When we did the Integrated Reporting Awards, we first started with the top 40 of the JSE, followed with the top 100. But then we realized that we cannot leave our public sector behind. For instance, if you look through just the Schedule two state-owned uh, state companies in terms of PFMA, collectively they are 21, and amongst them they own about 1.2 trillion worth of assets. So we thought then, if we can have an impact in trying to drive through the processes, create the incentives, encourage them and get everybody talking about something that people didn't care about. We will have achieved our objective of being resourceful to our country and playing a thought leadership role that will have an impact on the nature of reporting in South Africa. The other thing that's actually inspiring us is that the Global Competitiveness Report has ranked South Africa number one out of 144 countries for about four years in a row now. And I think it's an excitement that we actually have and we felt no matter how we are viewed, no matter how we are perceived, but that's the role and the space we want to play in. I think it's uh, the most topical issue around the world. And I think the reason is simple, is that most of the annual reports were prepared looking into the numbers. That is, it's a review mirror approach. But then with the introduction of in integrated reporting, which was prompted by the fact that for investors, a review mirror is not important. You also need to know how the company is going forward and how the reports were structured. They were structured in such a way that the user can only applaud you for what you have achieved in the past and then they should go and pray the whole year next year to hope that you'll achieve the same objectives. So therefore, it's something that was a wake-up call at a global level to say, no, no, let's find another way in which we can provide the review mirror through the annual financial statements that are audited, but let the reader and the investor be able to make an assessment of where this company is going, what risk is it exposed to, how is it managing its sustainability, and do I want to be associated with this company or can I bet with my last dollar on it for the near future. And that's really what it aims to achieve. And uh, it's been a long road for the IIRC, which is the International Integrated Reporting Council, to try and gather momentum on a global platform to make sure that from country to country, from company to company, the message is clear. Integrated thinking is what the world requires right now. The review mirror is something of the past. And I think they've achieved a lot.